Part 1. Icing your catch to take home. Even the perfect fish fillet and best recipes will go to waste if fish isn't stored and transported safely. Properly icing fish while you transport and store it ensures that the fish that end up on your table are delicious and safe to eat. The best way to do this is to keep the fish alive until you can clean and store it properly. Fish begin to deteriorate as soon as they leave the water. Even though you can't see it, bacteria and enzymes on the fish can spoil the meat or even make you sick. These bacteria multiply rapidly on harvested fish in warm temperatures. To prevent the fish from spoiling, keep the whole fish in a cooler with plenty of ice as soon as you catch them. There are many options for keeping fish cold, like crushed or cubed ice, frozen packs, or even frozen water bottles. Crushed ice is best because it packs closely and keeps the fish colder than other options. The most important thing is keeping your fish cold and packing ice and fish in alternating layers. Cubed ice is also a good option. Clean your fish using clean utensils. Rinse your gutted and filleted fish in cold drinkable water and pack it in ice for transport or storage. Pack the fish in single layers. A good rule of thumb is to use about two pounds of ice for each pound of fish and replenish the ice as needed. Hard-sided coolers are the best choice for transporting fish. They provide better insulation than soft coolers, are stronger than styrofoam coolers, and have a drain plug to release water from melted ice. Fish deteriorate when they soak in icy water, so having a drain plug on the cooler can help keep your fish fresh. If you plan to use your fish quickly and don't have ice, store the fish wrapped in wet paper towels to keep it cool and prevent moisture loss. Part two, storing your fish. How soon do you plan to eat your catch? There are three main ways to store fish. If you plan to cook the fish the same day, you can keep the fish on ice in your cooler. Remember to check your ice regularly and drain any water present in the cooler from melting ice. Then don't forget to add fresh ice. Ice will keep your fish closer to 32 degrees Fahrenheit, which slows down spoilage and doubles the shelf life of the product, thus preserving the quality. For the best flavor and quality, prepare your fish within 24 hours of catching. If you plan to eat your fish in a day or two, wash it in cold water, pat it dry with a paper towel, wrap it in wax paper or aluminum foil, and store it in the refrigerator on ice. Most household refrigerators won't keep the fish below 40 degrees Fahrenheit, so keeping the fish stored on ice is important, even if it's in the fridge. You can keep the fish in two containers, one with holes that allows melted ice to drain away from the fish and another to catch the water. Add ice on top of the fish and cover it with a lid or plastic wrap. If your fish is skinless or a fillet, wrap the layer of ice in plastic to protect the fish. You can also place it on a tray of ice and store it at the bottom of the fridge or fill a plastic bag with ice and place it on top of the wrapped fish. Whatever method you choose, keep fish protected from melted ice to preserve its quality. Keep an eye on your ice, drain water as it melts, and add fresh ice as needed. Freezing fish is the best option if you don't plan to eat your fish right away. Freezing preserves its quality and flavor for a few months. Reduce contact with the air by properly packing and storing fish to preserve flavor and protect it from spoilage. Wrap it in plastic wrap or aluminum foil, or place the fish in separate heavy-duty freezer bags. These materials create a moisture barrier that reduces the chances of freezer burn and blocks air to keep the fish from going rancid. If you use freezer bags, make sure to place the fish in single layers, press the bag gently to remove all air, and seal the bag. Generally, it will take about 16 hours for an inch thick package to freeze completely. Thicker or stacked packages will take several hours longer. Do not add water to the bag before freezing. Fish will absorb water until frozen, which will eventually affect its flavor and texture. After wrapping your fish in plastic, Wrap it again in meat wrapping paper, aluminum foil, or place it in a plastic freezer bag to prevent the plastic film from tearing. Label the package indicating the type of fish and the date it was frozen. Fish that has been properly iced and stored can last in the freezer for three to six months.